Hello there, fellow humans, and welcome to 10 Random Tank Facts. Number one, the most produced tank or tank series of all time is the T-54, T-55, with about 86 to 100,000 produced. Obviously, the Chinese have also copied them with their Type 59 model, both of which, or three of them actually, are in the game. The difference between the T-54 and the T-55 was simply that the T-55 was upgraded and it was also equipped with nuclear protection. Number two. The Pershing, in this game a medium tank, was actually classed as a heavy tank and was designed to fight heavy tanks. However, it didn't finish um, until the end of World War II and then it was too late to ship it. And by the way, that it was shipped, the war was basically over, so there was no actual use for it. And then after that, the Americans essentially abandoned tanks uh, because they thought that nuclear weapons are a way better option, uh, but then the Soviets acquired nuclear weapons as well so they basically had to go back to conventional tanks and build tanks again and then number three as they were building tanks again they also had to fulfill certain requirements the t 25 looks to be quite a small tank as you can see it's smaller than the m60 and also smaller than the m48 pattern and the reason why it was this small is because it was designed to um, be able to pass through tunnels um, in the Benes alps basically and also obviously a lot of these tanks are based on a track width of trains so they were able to be produced um, and then shipped very easily well trained very easily to a battlefield number four the t62 was quite a useless tank the original t62 was equipped with a 115 millimeter gun not a 100 millimeter gun and it was simply a very very short used tank between the t55 and then the t72 which is actually still in use today and now number 5, which is, I think, the saddest fact, the T-54E2, the best tier 8 tank in World Tanks Blitz. In real life, unfortunately, it was dropped in favor of the um, super heavy tank, the T-95. Obviously, it didn't really work out, but now we're stuck with this contraption in the game. So, thanks, Americans. Number 6, the mouse only one ever existed. They had two hulls and one turret. The first hull was destroyed, so they put the turret onto the second hull, and uh, that vehicle is now in the Kubinka Tank Museum in Russia. And another bonus fact, it had a hammer and sickle on the side here, because if it were to be captured by the Americans, then they should think that it wasn't a German invention, that it was simply a captured Soviet invention, but since the Soviet captured it, they knew it wasn't their own, so too bad. Number seven, the first ever tank used in battle was the Mark I heavy tank by the British and it was in the First World War in 1916. And it obviously doesn't really look like a tank because the first actual tank looking tank was the Renault FT. And this tank here in World Tanks Blitz, it was used in an event in 2016, I believe, um, 400 years of Mark I. And you could play it in a special mode where it was Mark I's against Mark I's only on Fort Despair, however. Speaking of British tanks, all British tanks have to have a tea boiling device in the tank installed a lot of other nations have adopted that since as well now we already had them earlier uh, the m48 and the m60 but here where they are again because number nine the m48 pattern is a first generation main battle tank while the m60 is a second generation main battle tank which means they're virtually the same in the game but they're very very different in reality and they were also used very different so if you are looking for historical accuracy, then this is not the game for you. And, obviously, at the end, speaking of not historically accurate, as you know, number 10, the T-30, is actually a heavy tank. It was first used in World Tanks PC as a T-10 heavy tank, but then was downgraded to a T-9 tank destroyer. So, they have went back there. Also, another very bad thing that has been done here is the Batchat 25T is classed as a light tank, even though in reality it was a medium tank, it was a medium tank project designed to replace the MX-13. So yeah, that's the list. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Goodbye.